gonna get started because why not so happy day 13 of the 30 day positive mindset challenge so we're gonna start off like we always do with our gratitude sticky note also I'm holding my phone a different way let me know what your thoughts on this are just thought I'd mix it up a little bit so hello Shelby hey so for the first thing we're gonna do um, our gratitude sticky note so I am going to do I am grateful for food I think or I think I've done I've done food before hello how are you let's do we've had really nice weather here so I'm gonna be thankful for the Sun I think that's what I'm gonna do so let's put that on my sticky note <gasps> hello perfect so here is my gratitude sticky note for this morning so we'll do that I hope you both had a wonderful Easter so for day 13 your task is to listen to some podcasts I have a couple that I truly love but if you go on there and just type in some words about inspiration or like if you're trying to start a business or whatever my friend Michaela actually got me started on podcasts I know Oprah has a good one I listen to Sahara Rose she's a really great podcast but maybe if you're feeling a little stagnant and not like you're growing during this time wake up and listen to a podcast it really helps me get started in the morning especially like it just kind of inspires me and makes me think about my day so your task is to find one of these podcasts I highly recommend Sahara Rose's podcast she's super funny she's super honest um, just go pick one of hers I can send you one if you want one but I would go do that and now let's end with a card so let me see We'll do this one. It's pretty cute. So, innovation. The concept of this card is that when you know what you want, it is important to invite it in. Many times we think we need to push or do, do, do in order to make something happen. There is another way, and that has to do with working with the laws of the universe. A huge part of that is become very clear about what it is you want. From this vision, you invite it. You do this by using the thoughts, feelings, actions, behaviors, beliefs that support you having this. It can be tricky to make sure all of these are working together. The first step is awareness. What are you telling yourself and others about your goal? What are you feeling about it? What are you doing to live it now? So I really do believe in like the universe and law of attraction and all that great stuff because I've even seen it in my own life where like if I really put my mind to something I'm gonna like get further in it and like the more that I work towards it like for example I had an audition that I really wanted and I started taking more classes and I started speaking up about it more and all these people came out of the woodwork to help me and it was just really great and a positive experience. So I think if you have goals or you have something that you want, think about like how you're feeling about it, think about like envision it, really work towards it and like already living it. Like maybe if you have like a manager position or something you want. Like wake up and like get dressed like you're gonna be a manager for the day or like walk into a room like you are the manager with like confidence and like you know what you're doing and like all this kind of stuff. Just start like trying to live the life you already want and let that energy come towards you. So the journal question is, what would you like to invite into your life right now? Write down the thoughts you have about it. What story are you telling yourself? Are these thoughts serving you? If not, what thoughts will serve you and your innovation, invitation, sorry, of this intro to your life? So I personally have been, um, hello, have been um, trying to invite more positivity in my life. I feel like a lot of times, like some places I am have just like a lot of negative talk and have a lot of like kind of being a downer and all that kind of stuff. So I've been trying to do that, which is why like, A, like this positive mindset challenge is something I've been working on or like 
one of the challenges I gave during the first week was like cleaning out your social media or during this time I've really been like trying to reach out to people um, seeing how they're doing or like cleaning all the clutter out of my house like one of the things I feel like for me honestly like positivity is just an overall like umbrella that I want in my life it's not something specific but I think that if you have something specific that you want in your life you can also work towards that add it to your vision board start looking up the way to do it oh i miss all of you guys too i know andrea just wrote this but all of you on here i'm like looking at all these names and it's making me so happy because i truly miss all of you so don't be afraid to facetime me but um back to what i was saying so um yeah but whatever you want in your life right now don't be afraid to reach for it i know all of you can achieve it and thanks for logging on, you guys. Um, my 30-day mindset challenge, day 12, or day 13, we're doing really good. We're almost halfway there, and I'm hoping this has been helping. And I will hopefully talk with you all soon. And I love you guys. I miss you too, Shelby, Andrea. Who else do I have on here? Alicia, Catherine, all of you. So don't be afraid to reach out. I know we're all going through some tough times, but I love you all and I will be on tomorrow at 1130 for day 14. So bye guys. Love you.